On the fifth day after the zombie virus incident at the hospital, the city was quarantined. Most of the military had left and had set up at the perimeters, after which they would send in squads to deal with the remaining zombies, of which most had been dealt with, or so they thought. Not all neighborhoods were under strict lockdown. There was talk about engaging a curfew, but for now, some civilians lived their lives as regularly as they could. Though the army would provide food at supply points throughout the week, many of the citizens went to the local supermarkets to get supplies. Though many communities helped each other, the dark side of humanity also showed its face as word got around that some supermarkets were hijacked by gangs and armed groups. They kept all the food and supplies for themselves and would shoot anyone coming near. In response to this, there were some citizens who felt the need to take up arms as well and take these gangs out. They felt that the army would not do enough to keep the peace and would take matter into their own hands as a vigilante group, a recipe for sure disaster. All right, let's first pick up Greg and Ryan. After that, let's head to Woozy's house. Apparently he has some assault rifles for us. No idea how he got them. Maybe a distant uncle, maybe something else. He has some connections. All I know is that I'm ready to serve out some justice, protect these fellow civvies, because I'm a true American. You know it. Greg? Ryan? What you want? You guys ready to serve us some justice, protect our fellow Americans? Of course I am. Thought you'd never ask. Let's go. All right, let's go to Woozy. Apparently he has, he has some uh, assault rifles for us. How did Woozy get guns? No idea. You know how he is. He might have some connections. Hey, how Woozy. He is? Are you there? Huh? Who is it? What do you want? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, there yeah, you go. Check this shit out. Stole this from a military vehicle. I've got more. Come to the back. Oh, shit. How much you got? Ooh, look One, at three. these babies. Ooh. Ooh. Help yourselves. Ah, that's the woozy I know. All right. All right, guys, stack up. So apparently, I heard that uh, some of the nearby supermarkets, some gangs have holed up in there and refused to give any of the food and water to... Uh, to anyone in need, so I think it's up to us to uh, to deal with the situation and uh, stop this uh, this chaos. All right, let's actually take my van. I need one of you to open the green gate. Don't we need some kind of protection? We've got protection. Oh, you do. Yeah, we've got bicycle helmets and Kevlar vests. How'd you get Kevlar vests? Uh, you don't want to know. Yeah, maybe you're right. All right, let's grab it. You got bicycle helmets, you say? It's actually better than nothing. Well, it's not the most fashionable thing, but it'll work, I guess. I think we look yeah. pretty cool. I am not wearing a bicycle helmet. Well, the Put Kevlar vests on are the, the helmet, woozy. Are the more important I'm part? I'm gonna die. I prefer to die not looking like an idiot. Put on the helmet. Well, he does have a have a very nice hat to begin with. I suppose it is a nice hat. All right, let's take my van. I'll drive. The first supermarket should not actually be too far from here. All right, everybody in? Yep. Yep. Here we go. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> that thing, that that thing needed repairing anyway. <laughs> Infrastructure's gone down ever since the military had blocked yep. all supplies. Well, again, we're just in quarantine. It's just like it's not like they uh, put up a curfew or anything. So people are definitely a little bit tense. On? No, unfortunately, there's no radio uh, here. Wow, we have this fancy like touchscreen panel, but no radio. Nope. So where are we going? All right, first supermarket should be, I took a wrong turn, should be behind this bridge. And we've been here since childhood. And you still don't know where the supermarket is? I know, I'm just a little bit on edge with this whole quarantine that's going on. Hey there, Mitch. What's up? Good old Mitch, always on the corner of the street. All right, you so- You know what he's doing there, right? 
Well, you know, again, everybody's now has to, uh, you know, make some sort of living with this quarantine with no one coming in or out. I mean, the military is actually dispersing uh, meals, but that's only on certain days and under a certain time. There's not enough for everybody, so the gangs that took over these supermarkets are real assholes. So there are a lot of people in need. Here's the first one. I actually see someone in the thing. He's holding something. Is that a whoa, gun? Whoa, 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 whoa. Is that a gun? Can somebody confirm? They barricaded the front. This must it be... looks like a gun. Okay, this must be one of the supermarkets where they took over. Someone holler over to him. See if we can surrender. He might not be the only one. Sir? Uh, excuse me, sir! Sir! Oh, God! Sir? Yeah, he was holding a gun. Yep, he popped something. Alright, boys. Get in there. Be careful, there might be more. You got him? Good, good, There's good. one more back there. Left side! He's down. Okay. Uh, check the back. Alright. Careful, yeah, that looks Ryan. Pretty clear. Oh, jeez! Oh, jeez! <laughs> we oh, lost no, Ryan. Ryan! Hold on. We're coming oh. for you. Oh, he got, got me! The son of a bitch him. shot me! I Get got him you, up. buddy. Oh! It's a good thing you wore your bicycle helmet. Oh! Oh, I feel so much better now. There Thank you. you. Oh, I feel pretty no, good I now. You. I got there you, buddy. Go. See, that's what that helmet is for. Looks like they barricaded this uh, back entrance. See, Woozy? You too could have been protected like that. Listen, I'm not the one who got shot. Alright. Try and find if they have any, th any food left, but it looks to me like they kept most of it. Most of these bags are, are destroyed. They ate everything. Jesus Christ. What a bunch of fat pigs. Yeah, see, this is what happens to a town when you get in quarantine. Once people panic, they start turning into wolves. They have a they have a few rations and like what is this? They have some rice over here in the back. We might be able to Ow. disperse this, but it's not a whole lot. Uh, I think we should head to the next place. Yep, yeah, I agree. Is was was anybody hurt by the way? If you again, if you need some bandages, I have some bandages in Just the Just Ryan. I mean, I did take a bullet to the head, but I feel pretty good now. <laughs> okay, that's great. That helmet, yeah. really, it really helps. I know. Yeah. Who's uh, in? It's Woozy. Woozy hey. is very easy to uh, to recognize, though. He's the only one that looks different. Max. Hmm? I, don't, I don't appreciate that kind of racist talk, if we're being honest. Well, we all, I mean, fashion-wise, I, we I were mean. Friends. What's going on, man? You know, I, just, I thought you were better than that. I know. I'm sorry. I apologize, Ryan. I want to Thank be, you. you know, the Ooh, your this. regular civilian vigilante. Ooh, yeah. What wow. Is this? Look at this. Well, this is a crowded place. Let me actually get the truck up in here. Ooh. All right. Engine off. Well, the burger place is running. Yeah. Hmm. Guns down. We don't want you to You want some burgers? Yeah. Sure, you can actually grab me something. If they have something, I assume that they might be pretty low on supplies. But actually, I maybe take a shake. I'll take a uh, vanilla shake. What you got here? Oh, they got supplies here. Uh, They said they have rats on sticks. <laughs> That's fine. I'll take that. It's better than nothing. They have some beans. Uh, they they have at least have a rat burger. Crunch and crisps. <laughs> well, they got rice uh, as well. Water. They have... Uh... Oh, they got some fruit and... Sodas. They've got salted rat or they've got rat with sauce. I'll take the sauce rat. What what <laughs> what kind of sauce? Uh teriyaki sauce, apparently. Oh, that's very exotic. I'll take that. Let's actually I'm gonna check the employees only. Don't worry, people, we are uh your border town vigilantes. We uh are here to protect and serve. Does anyone want any pumpkins? Oh, that sounds real good with my rat. Uh, yeah, I'll take a pumpkin. Yeah, they actually have whole pumpkins here. That's actually great. They look a little rotted, but uh, you know, Ryan won't notice. All right, I just throw it down the gullet. They have a lot of water in the back. They have a lot of rice in the back. Looks like this supermarket is pretty chill. This is all pretty legal. They're doing their greatest at it.
Let's see all these people are standing in line here. I think they'll all be helped. So this is all good. This is all fine. <laughs> Carry on, people. You're doing a good job. We're just your annoying, you know, uh, American vigilante citizen. All right. Let's continue. The this only law is our law. Exactly. Is everybody in? Yep. Yep. All right. Now, there should be one more supermarket next to this, like, industrial complex. It's a little bit further away, but maybe that one is taken, too. I heard some bad things about that place. I mean, the first supermarket wasn't that bad. It was just a small group of thugs that took that. And, and I don't know about you guys, but I feel pretty good about us doing that. I mean, I feel that we got some good karma out of that. I feel pretty good about killing those people. Yup. No regrets. Alright, it should be down the road here. It's weird, isn't it? If you're at the edge of town, you wouldn't actually think that the borders are closed here. It's also no, honestly, it kind of looks like just a normal day. Exactly. Alright. I mean, the, zo the the zombies were greatly diminished because of the army. What's that? Is oh, that, oh, whoa, whoa, I think whoa, I just, hey. just shot at us. Yep, okay, get out. Oh, get out. Jeez. Take him down. An asshole. He's down, he's down. Oh, they barricaded this up good. Oh, it doesn't even look like a supermarket. I know. Be right. careful. Oh, I see actually... another one. He's got a gun. All right, take him out. This might be the biggest yeah. group yet. He's down. Check your corners. Oh, we got more. Oh, take him out. Ah, uh, I love this, and they refused me for military training. Said my personality There's was too unstable. people in the store, unstable. too. Watch out. Let's kill him. One down. I see one. Another one down. down. Let's actually get into the store. I'm gonna go in the storehouse to the side. All right. Yeah, and I'm gonna check back here again. I know I had a bit of a. Fall. I feel like this time I've go. Oh, jeez. You got him. Good job, buddy. Got All right, two. You got the back as well. Oh, I hear fire. I'm shooting. Are we good? Oh, that's just woozy. That's me. All right. Looks like we cleared the area. Oh, look at all of this stuff that they have. Must have hoarded up here. They must have moved it from the supermarket to here. Maybe they're gonna we're gonna transport it to somewhere else. Assholes. Was there any food in the store? Oh, there's still mm -hmm. a guy in here. Another guy here too. Where are you, uh, Greg? I'm back in the store. There was a guy just standing here. Oh, was there? It's like you guys Listen. missed him. Was he in the I back? Well, there goes uh, Woozy uh, slacking off again. What? That wasn't my job. Uh, I'm gonna check uh, some of these buildings back here. Yep. Oh, jeez, I see somebody. Oh, yep. There's a guy. He's Take shooting at me. Good job. Self defense. Okay. You got that He's helmet on. Right for us. It's in the Constitution that we Americans get to defend ourselves. It's like the back's clear. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> uh, good thing you were <laughs> wearing oh, your, Uzi, you your helmet. <laughs> oh, you so vicious! You shot me. Oh, I feel I feel pretty good now. It's that helmet. It's that I helmet. tell you. Yeah, I shot him in the ass, and he, his helmet protected him. It did. I seen it. Looks like we're pretty clear in here. All right. We good here? I'm on, on the second floor. Check every First room. First floor is clear. Clear. Here's some gunfire. Yep. Cleared that room. All right. Looks like this is most of them. All right. I'm gonna call some friends. We're gonna take a truck. Grab all this uh, this rice and these other supplies that these guys have. Maybe bring them to the second supermarket. They know what to do with it. They can then uh, disperse it to uh, more people in need. Good job, guys. Yeah. 
Though these particular armed gangs were taken out, the city continued to spiral into chaos. The army said it would provide plenty of food in the coming time, so there was no need for hoarding. But the people grew more desperate and panicked with each passing day.